Hello, my name is Steve, I'm a musician, and today I'll be listening for the very first time to three songs by Eminence. They are Paralyzed, Infectious, and Erase. So I previously checked out their song Ghost. I'd never heard Eminence before, that song. And someone by the name of Derek Charles persistently asked on that channel, sometimes persistence does work, uh, that I check out these three songs, their official music videos, in a row. So, uh, Derek, your wish is my command. I've never heard any of these songs before. I've never seen a music video by Eminence before, so I don't know what to expect. Uh, I'm excited. And... Go! We have a piano. Oh, that's nice. Let me turn this up. Lovely little hair flick. This sounds pretty epic so far. Nice drum fill. Yeah, good fill. All right, it's real nice. Love little lead guitar going over the top of this. Well, everyone else grooves. I love that slightly scream, but also in tune vocal. Reminds me of uh, Sam Carter from Architects. The drums sound great. This is beautiful. All right, I'm a big fan of this chorus already. Dude, how the fuck did I not hear about Eminence before like three weeks ago? Okay, someone's just kidnapped the drummer. Should we alert them? I'm enjoying the repeated lead guitar stuff. Over the top. Nice stops. They don't let it ring out. Big fan of those gaps. This band is getting mauled. The piano motif has come back in. This is really good, guys. Yes. Ring out, let the drums work on the tom-toms. These guys are great. Oh yeah, I forgot. Dude plays violin. Enjoying the low floor tom work. that high string work on the violin there as well. This is so good. Riffage. Two vocal screams there. One low, one high together. I love that. Creepy eyes. This is a bit of a banger already. I would call this song a banger. Lovely layers coming in in this bit. Very full sound. This is so well produced. The drums sound excellent. The story in the music video is quite mysterious. Beautiful. What an excellent song. All right, so we're going to go straight into uh, Infectious. A lone violin to begin. 
They're still getting kidnapped, the poor gentleman. Still just a violin on its own. It's a very sad tone. More string instrument coming in. Sounds very low. Must be another. I'm assuming it's the guy's violin again. Just another track recording. Oh! That was very nice. All right, we got some digital melodic things happening here. Piano with some interesting production on it. Mmm, 16th on the hi-hat. I do like those. Gives it a funky feel. Yes! Okay, fuck. These guys are awesome. Effortless groove in their riffs. I can't believe I've not listened to more of these. Lovely little lead part. Great character to his voice. Wow. Yes! Putting a great amount of soul and emotion into the delivery of the vocals. These guys can write a chorus. The first four notes are like, yeah, this is good. He's got such great control over his voice. These guys are so fucking good. How have I not heard of it before now? I don't understand. This is two and a half years old. Oh, shit. Lovely drum fills from this uh, gentleman. Quiet. A lot of space left in the verses. Guitars are really subtle. Harmonized vocals. Violin comes back. You know, the violin really works, actually. Could have been a gimmick, but it's great. That voice. Yes. They're both getting absolutely mauled in their kidnapping, but also, equally, they're fine and playing in a conservatory. That's confusing. Interesting vocal delivery. It's like he can barely get the words out. I'm sure that's intentional. Great scream! Oh, he's chewing through his ropes. Oh, this is good. I want my drum kit to sound like this guy's drum kit. It's awesome. Okay. That was longer than the first song, but it felt shorter. It was really good. Oh, it's still going, I see. Ah, yes, because of the trio of string instruments. My boy's having a hard time here with the kidnapping. Oof. 
violin is gorgeous. Public service announcement. Okay. Well, that was delicious. What is for dessert? What is a race like? There we go. So like the last song, we have a violin to start, playing a melancholy tune. He's cleaned himself up. That voice is pretty, pretty good. I do love a bit of marching snare. Building up to what though? What you got? Lovely pause. Sure, what's going on in the video? Doesn't look like anything good. Yes. Beautiful. All right, a unique drum beat, how rare. I like it. That's got a bit of energy to it. This reminds me of something else. Maybe a bit of Sousin? Sousin? Can't remember how to pronounce that one. This is very nice! It's not quite as complex as the first two songs of these three that I've listened to, but... It's pretty. I mean, the violin helps. Love that riff. It's only got one note, but the rhythm's good. Ringing out the bass. Just the bass. How rare? He's great at adding that emotional grain to his vocal delivery. Yeah! Great screen vocal. Drummer's doing a great job of leaving room for the vocals and the guitars. Keeping the impact there. Woof! Well. Thank you, uh, Eminence. Thank you, Derek Charles, for the recommendation of seeing those three in a row. Um, I can see why you would say watch those three in a row in that order, because there's some sort of a plot line that goes through those three, right? They get kidnapped, and then they are kidnapped still, and then they become some kind of, like, uh, unclear. Uh, uh, ex experiments for someone? 
Um, this one, they're very neat ties and jackets. Looked somewhat Germanic. Um, well, musically, that was delicious. Uh, clearly, these are uh, a few folks that put a lot of thought and effort into how they write their songs and what layers they put into it. They decided to have violin. And I wonder if that's because, you know, the vocalist is like, well, I guess I happen to be able to play violin. So if you ever need a string instrument in this band, let me know, right? Uh, and it really works. It doesn't feel um, as token as, say, moments when Yellow Card did it. Um, this, I think, the style of music somehow over the years, we've, we've allowed metal to include some orchestral moments. Um, you'll hear some of that in Architects records, or I mean, way back in the day, Metallica did some orchestra-laden concert, and everyone went, "Oh, that might work." So that does work. Oh, that was really nice. The vocalist particularly impresses me in this band. What a wonderful character to that voice. Adds emotion to the delivery as well. A little bit of grain um, to give it that sort of like. Angsting, like this really means a lot delivery. Great screen vocals, clearly a gifted singer. I'd love to hear them live, because um, I suspect, based on the recording, that he's got a good live voice. But who knows? I mean, it's all production, I doubt it. That sounded like a very good beginning point of vocals. So that was amazing. Uh, love the drummer, it had some great fills in there. Love the sound of that drum kit. They recorded that really well. Um, that was delicious. And they made some interesting choices with the guitars. Uh, some nice, uh, high lead bits that were kind of looping and allowed everything else to sort of feed off of that and made the stops they put in the kind of jarring rhythms accentuated more because you have this kind of consistent lead thing to bounce that off of. That was cool. That works really well. Um, of the three songs, fucking, I loved Paralyzed and Infectious. I think Infectious on first listen might be my favorite of those three. A little bit more of the kind of heaviness, angstiness that I enjoy. Um, Array seemed a little bit more simple uh, compared to the other two. Um, that doesn't matter, it doesn't have to be complicated. Um, that was fine, that was, I really enjoyed Array. This is a good song. If that was the first song I'd heard of it, Imminence, I'd be like, oh man, these vibes are incredible. But because I just listened to Paralyzed and Infectious, which I thought were epic, it didn't land as hard for me. But I get how story-wise in the music videos, it makes sense to listen to that one third. Um, but they were great. I can't believe I've not he even heard of this band until this year. That's kind of blew my mind because I listen to a lot of these kinds of music. Well, that was great. Thank you to everyone uh, who, when I did the reaction to Ghost by Eminence, was commenting on that and saying, you need to listen to more, you need to listen to more. I, and I also called out Derek here a couple times. That stuff really helps me to delve more into a band. I'm like, well, clearly more, this might not just be one good song. I need to hear some more. Um, and I did. Three in one video. I'd heard done that before. That's kind of crazy. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching along. I'm looking forward to listening to some more Imminence at some point in the future. Um, great. Thanks for watching the video. Maybe I'll see you another time. Bye.